Today I'm sharing eight timeless spring outfits with a far-fetched lookbook, featuring all the key 2021 fashion trends. I'm very excited to share today's lookbook as I have a rail full of beautiful, timeless pieces that I've just got in from Farfetch. I'll be sharing what I chose and why, and sharing a few different ways I would style each of these pieces, so there's lots of outfit ideas today. For full disclosure, Farfetch very kindly gifted me some pennies to spend on their website, and I borrowed a few extra pieces as well so I could share even more outfit ideas. Now I have to admit, I procrastinated quite a lot when choosing these pieces, but in the end, I settled on a rail of really wearable spring outfits. Items that not only fit the for the 2021 fashion trends, but pieces that I knew would be a great investment. If you like this video and my styling ideas, I would be very grateful for any thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, that would be lovely too. Also, don't forget at the end of this video, follow the link in the description box below to find my daily outfit ideas and videos over on Instagram. So without further ado, let's get stuck in with my eight spring outfits with this beautiful top that I'm wearing. Now, one of my favorite things about Farfetch is that they feature such a wide variety of brands, from the sustainable collections to the emerging designers, all the finest luxury brands for those timeless investment pieces, and pretty much all of my favorite brands under one roof, which is how I came across this pretty sweetheart neckline blouse. As we know, florals are one of the big 2021 fashion trends this season, and it was definitely a gap that needed filling in my own wardrobe. I just fell in love with this blouse, to be honest. I just thought it was so pretty, and I do find this neckline really flattering on my shape. Plus, I thought it would be a really wearable way to introduce that floral trend for spring summer. Now, in truth, my favorite way to style a blouse like this would be with some sort of denim. I like the contrast against the blue, but also the femininity of the blouse against the edge of the jeans. Plus, of course, there's a little Parisian element, which you know I love. As you can see in these spring outfits, you could add a touch of the 70s trend, simplify the look with straight leg crops, and even dress it up a touch with heels and layering a blazer over the top. I forgot to say actually, do let me know your favorite piece or your favorite way I've styled each piece in the comments section below. It's always really lovely to hear from you and everyone's different opinions. And as you would hope, I do have an exclusive discount code for you in the description box below if you fancy spoiling yourself at Farfetch too. Next up in this spring outfits lookbook to a designer that I've liked for a very long time, Melissa Odebash. Known for creating some of the best fitting bikinis around, she also creates one beautiful collection of resort wear. So when I spotted this scalloped edge dress in navy, I couldn't resist. Now naturally, you can imagine this would be a perfect dress for the beach, but in this lookbook, I wanted to share a few different ways of styling it that you might not have thought of. I particularly like the 2021 fashion trend of wearing a dress like this with a pair of mules or pretty sandals. We saw it a lot on the catwalk, and not only do I love the look, but I also think it's very practical and wearable too, which is the key point really. It gives me a little bit of height, but it also means I could wear these heels all day long without killing my feet. Another option would be to style it with a lovely trench coat over the top. I personally really love navy and camel together. It's one of my favorite color combinations. I'm actually wearing a body underneath the dress, but you could easily add a slip if you wanted a little more coverage. You could also change it up and nip in the waist by adding a belt. And depending on the weather, style it with sandals or belly flats would look pretty too. However you decide to style it, I think this dress will get worn on repeat by me this spring summer. Now when it comes to investment pieces, I don't think you can ever go wrong with a stunning trench coat and I found this beautiful interpretation by a brand called Batsheva. A great trench should be for life, so find yourself a beautifully made, timeless version and you'll never need to replace it. And oh my, is this a beautifully made one. I fell in love with this the moment I spotted it on Farfetch, but I have to say, now seeing it in person, feeling the quality for myself and spotting all those little details, it's even nicer than I thought. It's original, stylish, and effortlessly chic. It's got a beautiful cut that feels feminine and on trend, yet timeless. 
this trench coat is definitely that standout piece that you would have in your wardrobe for years and I absolutely love it. The quality being as it is, I actually like styling it like this the most, letting the trench be the star of the show. Like you saw before, you could layer it over a dress, mixing in navy or perhaps the pastel trend that we've seen a lot of for 2021. While the trench coat is a big fashion trend for 2021, it's also a piece that we know will last and the perfect finishing touch to a very simple everyday look like this one. Absolute perfection, I love it. Now, if like me, you're keen to keep your wardrobe as sustainable and ethical as possible, Farfetch actually have their own positively conscious collection dedicated to designers embracing just that. In there, I found so many favorites, including Giacomus, Ghani, Reformation, Stella McCartney, of course, and this beautiful spring summer outfit by a brand called Lem Lem. So I'm sharing three different ways I would style this dress, playing with shoes and accessories to add a different feel to each outfit. Monochrome is, of course, a 2021 fashion trend and a really easy look to recreate, but I equally love this dress dressed down with sandals and a beach bag, either adding tan details or going au naturel. I'd really recommend having a look at her collection in full on Farfetch at the end of this video, as I think she has such a beautiful collection of beachwear and a really ethical approach as a company. Next up, I headed to the Frankie Shop, a brand I've been lusting after for a while, but this is the first time I've added it to my wardrobe. They're known for their unfussy, minimal style and affordable approach to luxury pieces. As I mentioned earlier, if you want to tick a fashion trend box this spring, adding statement sleeves or shoulder details is definitely a winner. So when I spotted their best-selling Eva t-shirt with this hugely original shoulder pad detail, I had to add it into this spring lookbook. I know this won't be for everybody, but personally, I love this tee. The cut, the color, the fact that it rocks the fashion trends in the most minimal yet hugely effective way, it just ticks all the boxes for me. Available in black, white, and the mocha brown that I chose, or as a t-shirt dress if you prefer. Style it up with skinnies and ankle boots for a sprinkle of rock chip vibe, laid back and tonal with sandals and a straw bag, or as a statement top for the office with tailored trousers. With or without the blazer, I think it works really well. I do love finding pieces like that. It's so simple, but really, really original. Now, one thing I didn't realize about Farfetch was just how many of my favorite French brands they also have. And it was while I was on that little Parisian style browse that I came across this beautiful Mez Demoiselle blouse. Statement sleeves are of course one of the main fashion trends for 2021, but I would say this is probably the most romantic version I've seen. Those ruffles are just stunning, and I love the way they drape and gather as you move. I did have a hard job deciding on the colour, as it was also available in both a gorgeous mustard yellow tone, and I also like the blue, which gave it a whole different kind of vibe. But I decided on the pink, as I just love pastel tones, particularly this spring, as I thought it would be the most versatile with the colour palette I already have. So a few different ways to style it here keeping it casual and relaxed for every day. Doing a wrap shape at the front and tying it at the back gives the top a totally different look. And of course, I definitely use this blouse as the perfect cover up by the pool. When it came to shoes, I felt a bit like a kid in a candy store and I found so many pairs that I fell in love with. I liked these and these and these and these I could go on. But in the end, I decided to keep it classic with a style I knew I would have in my wardrobe for years. A minimalist pair of beige sandals with that perfect heel height you could wear all day. Now these are designed by a brand called Studio Amelia, an ethical collection created between London and Sydney in 2019. From a practical point of view, they've got a lot of padding on the sole and are made from Nappa leather, so they're really comfy. But from an aesthetic point of view, I love the delicate, minimal style. And they're the perfect height for day wear too, high enough to feel like you're elongating your shape, but not so high you're doddering around all day in six inch heels. They're also available in both black and white, but I went for the neutral beige as I thought that would mix and match with the pieces I've already got in my wardrobe. 
I was already aware that Farfetch had a pre-owned collection on their website, but what I didn't realize was just how large the range is. I found so many beautiful vintage pieces. I could make a whole lookbook dedicated to it. But I finally decided upon this pair of beautiful 1970s YSL sunglasses. I'd wanted a pair of brown or tortoiseshell sunglasses for a while. The style is one of the 2021 fashion trends, but I also find that color and design the most flattering for my face shape. And as you will have seen with all of these outfit ideas today, they will pretty much go with everything. So do have a look at their pre-owned collection as well because there are lots of gems in there. So that's it, one beautiful rail of spring outfits from Farfetch. Ticking lots of the 2021 fashion trend boxes, but also a really wearable rail of clothes that not only are great investment pieces, but I know that they're going to mix and match with the wardrobe I already have. I really enjoyed creating this lookbook. I was kind of in my element. So I really hope you've got some outfit ideas and inspiration today. Don't forget to let me know in the comments section below your favorite piece, but also your favorite way I styled it. And don't forget to follow the link in the description box below over to Farfetch's website. Have a good look through all of the collection for yourself. And if you do decide to purchase something, don't forget about that discount code. Thank you so much for watching. I shall see you next week.